Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are diving into the world of Samsung FRP Bypass. If you have recently reset your de Samsung device and are stuck at the Google account verification screen, don't worry, we have got you covered. I will walk you through the steps to bypass factory reset protection safely. And effectively, let's get started. Note down, friend. In this video, I am not using any type of computer, software, laptop, etc. In this video, you need a, another phone to sharing the data. So, this is my verify page and I cannot bypass this page because I forget my recent Gmail ID which signed in on this device. But I forget so how to bypass this page. So, let's start a tutorial without wasting any time. Note down one thing another friend. Make sure your battery is up to 80%. This is my another vivo phone and this is my samsung phone so let's start the first go to your language section and then go to this english uk go to start and most important things go more go agree and connect a wi-fi network and make sure both phones are connected same wi-fi network then this process is working without same by same by far you cannot do this process so please make sure both phones are connected the same way by far now do this and go to this emergency call section and write a usg code and go to this sensor make wait five seconds after completing five seconds this is the testing page without this page you cannot do this process so first go to this page and then go to this blue section and the after completing process simply click and click back 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 and now Open the talk back. Click on use. Now again do the same process. Now click while use the app. Now click use voice command. And now open Google Assistant. Open settings. Now turn off this page. Turn off the talk back. First go to your Samsung account and wait few seconds. And then go to this log screen. In this page and click on this back button and then go to account and backup section there is an option of bring data from old device click on this and click to agree okay now go to play store and download the same app smart switch samsung smart switch okay friend now bring from old device tap many times and now go to this open site click on this continue button click more click allow now let's go change your phone to transfer your phone to transfer now get connected so first you transfer your data to click receive data and now there is click wireless now click on this galaxy android and now click on this wireless option don't skip the video you skip the video cannot do this process wait few seconds get connected connecting to transfer your data now invitation to connect to so simply click on this accept button if you click on decline button you cannot do this process to so please Make sure click on this accept button. 
now searching for data to transfer scanning okay friends now go to this custom option and click on this next button swipe up and now go to this account section and now click on the last option transfer click on this transfer your account now okay friend now done message complete so this phone is now the process is complete so i remove this phone and go to home screen now click on the start button click agree click agree click more click agree click and now go to this click next section after doing this one process again go to this emergency call and open the testing menu and then go to this speaker section and then go to version and after doing this process then go to this start option option click agree then this process is working if you skip that this process you to so you cannot bypass the google frp page because this usd code is a testing page now go to this next button Okay, friend. Now you can see there is a skip option. In the starting of video, there is a no skip option. Skip means bypass the page. So I can easily bypass this page. This by this option. Click on this skip option. Now click more. Click accept. Now skip. Skip anyway. Click OK. wait few seconds friends if you skip the video you cannot be able to do this process click skip skip click finish now click on this okay button click agree now choose your language click on this english button click on this next now click continue click skip skip now go to this install button and apply now finish after successfully successfully remove frp your phone look like that thank you for watching